Will Smith refreshing the Fresh Prince? We've got the details, but first, Drake is spotted in Toronto amidst controversy uh, for not responding to the deadly OVO shootings after party. Drake has come out to watch Serena Williams. Drake running through the six to see Serena Williams play at the Rogers Cup. His appearance comes as the rapper is being criticized for not speaking out about the Toronto nightclub shootings that took place following his OVO festival after party last week. As Entertainment City first reported, two people were killed in the deadly violence. Drake just might be spotted around his hometown again this weekend with Zac Efron. The actor tweeted, Drake, I'm in town for the We Are Your Friends tour. Want to run through the six for a bit? Hashtag woes. If they find some time to hang, we'll get the scoop for you. We're chatting with Efron today and you can Catch the interview on Entertainment City Monday. And as for Drake showing up to support Serena Williams, Drake and the tennis superstar have been linked for years with rumors they were dating back in 2011. Williams recently shot down new romance rumors saying they're, quote, just like family. Williams made headlines this week when she showcased her insane abs in New York Magazine after she was body shamed for what critics called her masculine figure. Someone else is promoting some serious body love. Ashley Graham, who has had a massive year of achievements, not the least of which was becoming the first plus-size model to appear in an ad in a Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue. Alex Depatie caught up with Graham in Montreal. This is a role that I have not taken lightly at all. I, I, you know, you don't ever sign up to be a role model. I'm just letting them know it doesn't matter what age, shape, or size you are. Just be comfortable with who you are. Now this is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down. Now this is the story all about how the Fresh Prince of Bel Air is kind of, sort of getting a reboot. <laughs> TV Line reveals Will Smith, the star of the 90s sitcom, is set to produce a revival that would put a new spin on the Fresh Prince story while maintaining the series' original spirit and fish-out-of-water theme. But sounds like producing is the only role Smith will take. And don't start doing the Carlton just yet. The reboot is still in the very early stages. You want some bubbly, courtesy of Jay-Z? The rapper is launching his new champagne, and it will cost you $125 per glass. The expensive and exclusive fizz will be the first product from Armand de Brignac since Jay took over the brand last year. One bottle of the All Pinot Champagne comes with a $760 price tag. Meanwhile, Jay's wife, Beyonce, is striking a pose on the fashion industry's most coveted cover. Vogue's September issue. The issue will hit newsstands and your next issue app later this month. Henry Cavill and Army Hammer are cracking the spy genre in The Man from Uncle. But what's their dream reboot role? They tell our Riaz Megji. You know, the cool thing about this movie is it introduces a 60s spy series to a brand new generation of viewers out there. If you had to choose a series that you loved growing up that you'd love to see become a movie, what series kind of came up with you? Gilligan's Island. Oh. The mate was a mighty sailor man, the skipper brave and sure. I love Gilligan's Island. Yeah? A team of it. That's a good show. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you just want to co-star on Gilligan's Island then? Yeah. Yeah. There you go. You can play the professor. Perfect. Yeah. yeah. You? I'll play Gilligan. Okay. Kind of the idiot, you know. How could you bite yourself on the neck, Gilligan? I stood in a chair. Where are you going to go? Swimming. The Man from Uncle hits theaters today. Remember to tune in for your entertainment news first in the morning here on Entertainment City and anytime on Twitter at NCity.